Saturday night. Not exactly the kind of night for nothing but romance. But in this case, romance didn't have its name on my bullet. I was sitting alone at the Shanghai Inn, having a slow drink, a fast-talking bartender. My name's Dick. <laughs> Dick Thud, with two Ds. <laughs> I didn't think much was going to happen. Joey set up another round. That knocked him over quicker than I thought. <laughs> Just about that time when the smoke had cleared, it had been so thick you could have cut it with a rubber tip spatula. She walked in. <laughs> hey! you like what you see? Sure, I like what I see. It looks pretty good. Of course, some men might call it a little unusual, a little <laughs> flagrante. But what the hell? It just proves to me that Barbara Windsor slept with Dirk Bogard. At least Edward Heath didn't sleep with George Melly. Say that. Enough exchange and pleasantries. I need your help. I see you're packing quite a piece. <laughs> if you don't have the safety catch on, we're both going to get hurt tonight. Guess I'm firing blanks. Yeah, that makes it all the better. A stiff one? <laughs> you haven't been to innuendo town lately, have you? Someone's following me and they want something I've got. I can't imagine what it is. <laughs> it's this tin of cocktail cherries. <laughs> I've heard of a woman keeping memories, but this is something else. <laughs> Why do they want this so much? Wait. Are these the famous Maltese cherries? <laughs> yes, they are. <laughs> these are worth a fortune. They fetch a high price on the antique market. What's a frail like you doing packing a load of cherries like this? That's just one of the tricks I do. <laughs> well, you're not a dame at all. Well, you are, but maybe. I don't know. What do you want from me? I'll tell you what I want. I want to be in charge of this town. <laughs> Well, when you're wearing pants that short, with an attitude like that, you're bound to run things, bub. Sure, I'm with you. What's the matter? It's blank. You said you can't have any blanks. Ha! I'm glad you went down easy. I didn't want to have to use the lemon. Good turn. Good turn. You said we didn't come here. No. Whoa. No. Move. You know what? What? I've got your helmet on. No. I yeah. got the wrong helmet. It's squeezing my cheeks. Just concentrate. Why don't you clean the mouthpiece on this yeah, thing? Like it smells like dung. It doesn't I, matter. I can't wear this. Yes, what are you doing? Oh, no, oh, dental hygiene. No, leave my cheeks. Leave my helmet on. Yeah. Ah, 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 yeah. ah, I'm doing good, good, good. Ah, 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 I was wrong. It is my helmet. Ah, no, just concentrate. Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Oh, no. Oh, no. Seagull. There, take that down to the galley. You're so brave and agile with it, I'll never be a, a black-bearded, blue-blooded pirate like you. That's why I'm Blue Bottom Pete, the meanest pirate in all the seven seas. I have a butt like a mandrel at high heat, and I don't take any guff from no one. Now, Jimmy, it's your turn to learn how to be a pirate. How now watch I... how I'm walking. 
You gotta stick your gut out, load yourself with rum and tepid water, and every day you gotta rub hot chili peppers on the inside of your ears. <laughs> All right. What about singing, though? Ah, now you're catching my drift. Singing is what I do best. I sing the saltiest, bodiest ballad in all the seven seas. Why, Neptune himself can't match me. All right. Three weeks out of Portugal, I killed five men, and that's not all. I killed seven others. I killed me, mother, because I'm a mean pirate. I'm a mean pirate too, I go right beyond the pale Sometimes I run myself up the mast and stick out my hand to dry my nails You know, in the 90s, a lot of people talk about dental hygiene and taking care of yourself. But isn't it time that you took care of your ears? Using those nasty cotton buds, it doesn't work. That's why Brackman Laboratories has ear floss. Just take one roll, work it in, move it out to the other end, and you can clean the entire aeral cavity in a matter of seconds. Ear floss. It's a good idea whose time has come. If you're one of the millions of people who wear dentures and are slightly worried about eating crispy foods, use new Denti Grip <laughs> Hello. I used to weigh 55 stone until I used the ancient Chinese herbal suppositories, Yung Wang. Each of these suppositories, when inserted, swells to 50 times its size. It's They're suppositories. <laughs> now, there's no use guessing what kind of infection you have when you have a cold. Microcrystalline embedded litmus paper in your handkerchief tells you right away. <laughs> a 60% infection? <laughs> yes. Yes, it does give me a buzz. I've been breeding uh, champion pit bulls and rottweilers for 20 years now on pedigree meat and it's they're just wonderful dogs and uh, just like that. this beauty regimen only takes a few minutes is guaranteed using the secret mexican plant the jalapeno pepper and putting it into a face cream has never been done before and it's just as easy you just apply let it sit for god I'm talking about the new generation of hover mowers. <laughs> Little Timmy has a temperature, but you don't want to use an oral or an anal thermometer. Well, what are you going to do? These new nipple clamp thermometers are fantastic. <laughs> Just try one now. Mmm. I've got a fever. <laughs> I've got thousands of used televisions and videos in my warehouse. Come to my warehouse. 